everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swishing and Reviewing LVS. This was the play of the day today. And actually, I knew this would not reverse today. It dropped off, sold off in the morning. We did it fast and quick, which is the way that I like to do day trades, specifically shorts, which this was. This gapped out in earnings last night and fell today. So here's what it did. Closed the night before, boom. 49.42, open in the morning here, 47.96. I really saw this last night. I love this last night. I knew last night after I saw a report I was doing it today. Like there was nothing else I was gonna do today besides this. So here's the whole chart. Um, and again, I like to be aggressive because for me, the confirmation is the setup. I rate the gap in the morning. As soon as I get the setup, that's all the confirmation I need and I'm in. So sometimes we're in extremely early and then the benefit is we're out early and you have the rest of the day to yourself. We were done today before 9.45. In fact, we were done out of this trade, I think in less than 10 minutes. We shorted, it got in, got the drop, boom, out. I mean, it was just a beautiful trade. And I even said to people then when it pushed back, they could do it again. I don't know if anybody did, but I had a great exit on this actually. I basically had almost a low of the day exit on this now that I'm looking at this here. I did. That, that doesn't happen all the time, but I had a perfect exit on this today actually for the day trade. Uh, so very nice move by this. Let's look at the daily. And there you have it, people. I mean, these, these have, these casinos are trying to recover since the pandemic, but it's it's been rough. I mean, tourism, you know, any type of industry, vacation places, I mean, hotspots, you know, the casinos are back open, but this this wasn't good here today. I don't know what they said in the earnings, but it, the stock fell today and it's not gonna recover today and it's not gonna flip and go green. And this is on its own without the market. So I'm very good at shorting. I'm an expert in shorting. That really is the number one thing that I focus on each single morning, but I'm always doing gaps. So I'm always, sh doing gaps sometimes i'm shorting sometimes i'm going long but i'm mostly short so my niche is really gaps but also then on top of that there's an overlay where i have an extra niche where i short and i can read the one minute chart very well too which helps so usually i can predict the direction of bias that a stock is going to go in the first five minutes of the day by reading the trend and that's what happened here and this just dropped like a brick so while you can't short every gap down and you can't go long every gap up. This was a gap down today that you definitely could have shorted, and I'm glad that we did it. Uh, there was something else that people liked today, and I wasn't crazy about it. What the heck was it? Oh, it was this one. Yeah, see here, this is a good example of why you can't short every gap down. I did not like this. I did not like this, I do not like this, this didn't work, so this lifted. So this is a gap down though, all right? I didn't like it though. I didn't, I, didn't, I didn't like it, and I was right, it didn't fall. Um, it closed here at 37.06, boom, open in the morning here at 31.74, and it rallied. If you shorted this today, you lost. You couldn't make any money shorting this today. So, you know, you gotta find the good ones. That's the whole purpose of the rating system. That's what you'd learn in the class. If you come and take my class, that's what you're gonna learn. How do I know that LVS was a short and that NTGR was not a short? by the rating system. The rating system tells me. So that's the meat and potatoes and the crux of what I do. If you're interested in more information, if you wanna sign up for the class this weekend, there's still spots available. Class is July 24th and 25th, Saturday and Sunday. Um, great time to trade. People are always interested in trying to uh, earn their investment back from the course, which has been a fabulous week, to be honest with you. I've been hitting it, hitting it, hitting it. Did it again today, nice trade. Really a perfect exit here now that I'm seeing this. 1.35 in the afternoon, this could fall into the close, but I think the move was in the morning and we got it. So we'll see what we get tomorrow. Big night for earnings this week. Uh, big night tonight, Thursday night for earnings. So we'll see what we get. If you're interested in signing up for the course, email me and Melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day, everyone.